What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Erica if you are new. Welcome. I'm just bringing us into today's video. I'm about to get ready for the day. Happy Saturday. I hope you guys are looking forward to today's video. We're gonna have a leg workout, so if you're interested, just go ahead and skip on to it. I'm currently getting ready. I just got out of a five-hour lecture, and I just feel like I still look like I woke up. So enjoy this footage of me getting ready really quickly. <laughs> What's up? How is everyone? If you didn't already, go check out my last video. I do an entire get ready with me and I'm definitely getting better at mastering this everyday look. If you don't wanna hear me ramble, just go ahead and skip on into the workout. And for those who decide to stick around, I'm gonna be doing a Q&A. So go ahead and enjoy the workout and I'll see you guys at the end to do the Q&A. And if you have any questions or comments at all, be sure to leave them down below in the description box and I will definitely get back to you. Today, I will be applying my tanner as well, so we'll talk about that at the end. What is up guys? Didn't expect to see me, did you? I'm butting into this video on Saturday. I'm currently editing. I know this video is going up a little bit later. I can definitely hit that Wednesday, Saturday mark, but the 8 a.m. might be a little too early for me because it takes me so long to edit. I just wanted to give you the proper intro into this video. This video has a leg workout, which you're definitely gonna see right after I'm done here. Sometimes when I edit I realize I mess up a lot or I don't make the most sense so I'm trying to keep you guys informed that this video is gonna have a leg workout and then at the end I have a Q&A fail as well as my tanning routine so enjoy just wanted to clarify in case you're like what is this video about I will see you guys at the end and just keep watching Bye. <laughs>
welcome back i hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you did please be sure to give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe down below so you can be a part of my fit family now that we've gotten through the workout i'm really sore i also went to manhattan beach after hitting a workout with ty yes not with ty with kelsey i don't know i said with ty tyler and i went to the manhattan sand dunes there's only like one real dune that's even left and basically it's rented out to the city of Manhattan Beach and you can get a reservation for only like three dollars or so and basically what we did was we hiked up this huge sand dune so after that leg workout that I just showed you guys we immediately drove over grabbed some food at Whole Foods and then carved up for the most intense leg session honestly one of the hardest leg sessions of my life so I'm gonna do a whole video going to the Manhattan sand dunes either this weekend or sometime next week so expect that video from me I don't know how I'm gonna do it because it is the hardest workout of my life you can hardly get up the hill in one sprint that's what it is basically it's just uphill sprints and I couldn't even do one full sprint I can only do like a third or a half of it not usually a third and I can never get to the top but anyways my legs are shot today so this Saturday which is when you'll be watching this video today, I will be hitting an upper body workout, which will be in Wednesday's video, just to give you guys a heads up where my uploads are and whatnot. We're gonna go straight on into the q and I love Q and A's, just because it gives us a chance to really talk and interact, especially with those who send in questions. Those who do send in questions, I appreciate you to the moon and back. I truly, truly, I'm just like so touched whenever you guys ask me questions because it's so sweet and you guys ask the sweetest questions I don't really get anything that's too bad or inappropriate for the most part DMs are a whole nother subject Maybe we can do a video on that in the future like what's in my DMs because sometimes it gets crazy So let me get my phone in case you're wondering what time it is. It's currently 2.04 uh, Because Instagram has this new issue where they like basically get rid of all of your questions within 24 hours I like screenshot a bunch of them before they were on okay epic fail for some really odd reason i don't have any of the questions that i was planning to use to ask you guys or for you guys i don't know what i'm saying i'm really stressed now because this is not a q a we're gonna take another route okay so i asked you guys a couple of questions over on instagram and i wanted to talk about what your guys' responses were to the topic of what your goals are and the goals that you set for yourself in terms of fitness. Somebody told me that um, worlds.apart.blends, they said crossing the list, they're determined for more. I love that. I'm always determined for more. I do not settle. I have very, very high expectations, not only for myself, but like for the way I live, for like what I expect from myself in a day. I'm very much a busybody. I don't like to just sit around and do nothing. I see every open piece of time as an opportunity to better myself, so whether that's physically or with knowledge or whatever that may be. I'm very much, I can relate to you guys. So somebody said that they want to start losing weight and toning. I have no motivation. And that's from I am Drea underscore. Uh, so I relate sometimes with the no motivation, but the whole point is to keep going enough times in a row that when you don't feel like going, you go anyways, so that you take those four words or letters, those four letters, F-E-E-L, you take that out of it, then your results are gonna happen. It's a matter of turning off that mental barrier of how am I gonna get to my fitness goal? How am I gonna lose the weight? You stop thinking how and you just start doing. So stop thinking too much into it, take the emotion out of it and just go. With losing weight and toning, I just highly recommend cardio um, and a healthier, cleaner diet. So cut out some carbs, maybe check out how to track your macros. I made a video on that. And you can start trying to use, you might wanna try using macros that are meant for you, targeting weight loss. And my biggest tips for toning, I find the most amount of tone in my body through weight training. So it, it just works. I had set the goal for myself of wanting to drink a gallon of water every day and a lot of you guys were agreeing with me on that and that's awesome because somebody said to be as strong as you and those are always so cringy 
Like, okay. I always think it's important to continue to set goals for yourself. If you're lacking motivation, I just wanna let you know that I'm here for you and I will definitely give you guys my biggest tips and tricks for staying motivated and for me to stay motivated, I need progress pictures. I need inspiration, mostly just inspiration. I need inspiration and I need spare time. And sometimes it's hard to have one of those. Having both definitely makes your workout a lot better. You kill your workout. So on the days when you don't have as much inspiration, I want you to find people who you admire because I don't think there's anything more motivating than finding a role model or someone who has already done what you're trying to do and gone beyond that because they're gonna have the experience under their belt they're gonna have all of the advice and when it comes to weight loss and staying motivated I have been there I have been in those moments where I don't have any ounce of me wanting to do the workout. This has changed a lot over time and when I first got into it I was super strict and I wore myself down with training and dieting and I think it's about finding that happy medium so don't overdo it, don't stress it, make it fun and I think that's kind of how you keep with it long term as you figure out how to make it part of your life, part of your lifestyle. If you don't want to work out on a daily basis just wake up and just do it. Find a way, even in your morning, if it's only 45 minutes or less, just go and start moving your body. I don't care what it is, because it's all about just getting those endorphins and those good, happy chemicals going. So, I'm gonna leave it off on that. I'm gonna show you guys how I do my tanner tonight once I wash up everything off and go to bed or right before bed. So I will definitely include that for you guys, but I just love you guys so much and I hope you have an amazing day. Have the best weekend. Tyler and I are gonna be boogie boarding if we don't get sick or pray we don't get sick because last time we went boogie boarding about two weeks ago, I got strep throat the next day just because we were in the water too long. So we're gonna be over at Laguna or Manhattan or San Diego, I really don't know, but we're gonna be somewhere boogie boarding and if you guys are interested in ever coming and saying hi because I've been noticing that a lot of people are usually at the beach when I'm at the beach and it's like we're literally in spitting distance. We could probably say hi to one another. Please come say hi if you ever do see me in public. I know some people have messaged me over on Instagram. They're like, I saw you at the gym or I saw you at the store and I'm, I really wanted to say hi but I was too nervous. Like, please come say hi. We will have a moment, okay? I want to get to know you guys this is not something I'm only doing short term I intend to do this honestly as long as I possibly can I love making videos for you guys and it brings me so much happiness and I get ready for the day and I just feel good so I, I thank you for sitting here and watching this video as corny as that is and I've been using my hands a lot and I'm not even Italian but maybe deep down I, I am a little bit I will see you guys in a little bit when it's time to tan and I'll have no makeup on it means the world to me to have you here and I know that my videos have been a little bit off topic lately Lately, I'm coming back to fitness. I'm definitely trying to submerge us in just fitness because that's what you guys like. Apparently, you guys also really enjoy hauls, and I, I am the worst when it comes to shopping. Like, I never just go on a shopping spree. I'm not that kind of person. I only ever pick up pieces, so that's why it was easy for me to do that leggings review because it was more of a collection of my leggings versus buying a bunch of leggings and making a video for you guys. I know that's something that some YouTubers do, they'll create videos by like buying a bunch of stuff. I'd rather take you guys through my life and make videos that way. Um, that's one of the other reasons I love fitness, it's free, you know, aside from a gym membership, fitness is free. So it's the best thing you can possibly do for you and your body and your mental and physical health. So I encourage you to move your body and I hope you guys have an amazing Saturday. If you have any questions, comments below. I will definitely respond and I will see you guys in the next video. Don't forget, <laughs> my voice is quite um, strained here. Just keep watching and you guys can see exactly how I use the Bondi Sands tanner and I will be having a few collab videos coming soon. I have a coffee collab. I'm excited to talk about that one. And then I also have, I've got like a swimsuit collab, a cannabis collab. I got all sorts of stuff. So I'm really excited to share everything with you guys. So there's lots, there's lots coming, I promise. Have an amazing day. I will see you guys in the next one. Please be sure to like and to subscribe down below so you can be a part of my fit family. And I will see you guys in the next video next on Wednesday. See you then. Bye.
I just made lunch. I didn't record any of it. I should probably think about re recording it and showing you guys, but I keep forgetting. Anyways, I just made the most delicious sandwich with a Beyond Meat patty with some fries. I just have to show you. This one's gluten-free bread with a Beyond patty and I have some fries. I threw these fries in the oven. They were just freezer fries. This is for Ty if he ever comes home. I don't really know if he is at the moment, but that's waiting for him. And I'm sipping on my protein shake. What an angle that is. I've been sipping on this protein shake. Of course, this is my teeny bottle. Be sure to use my code, Ericacy25. This will be 25% off. And I'm about to demolish this sandwich. In case you guys don't think I eat my food, I do. That Q&A was such a fail. Instagram has changed their rules. You used to be able to access anything on your archive for like a year. And now it's only 48 hours. Otherwise, all your answers are gone. I didn't even tell you guys what's in this damn burger. Okay, I got some gluten-free bread. I'm gonna do my nails today, by the way. I got some Beyond Meat. Some Daya vegan cheese. Some tomato. I've got spinach. Pickle, avocado. I can't even show you the avocado. There's avocado in there. And then I put some mayo, mustard, and ketchup, and I cannot wait. Mmm. show you what this tan looks like until the next video but to say the least it works and I will show you guys the results over on Instagram so you can check me out there or you can wait until the next video but for the most part my head is always a lot paler than the rest of my body when I get up in the morning I'm just gonna rinse off my tan and then I sh will show you guys the results either in this video or the next one. My last tips about the tan are definitely wear something that you can really cover yourself on and try not to touch your pillows with. My whole bedding is white so I'm gonna be literally <sighs> like this. I'm wearing like old Christmas pants, socks, everything so I don't get my bed wet. Sorry for being for being a mess. I gave my best, but was it late? But was it late? Mm, yeah. We talk about this, can't forget. I'm seeing you in everywhere, in everywhere.